Hi, welcome to Hungary. How do you feel yourself? Oh, very good. It's very nice here. What's your plans in the future? Plans in the future is to keep coming back here. <laughs> How do you like Hungary? Fabulous. One of my favourite places. You have a Hungarian tour. What can we know about it? Um, well, it's a variety of, of everything. It's uh, different cities. Uh, yeah, different cities, firstly. But I don't want to embarrass myself to try and pronounce them. No, um, no, no. We don't. No. We can't say that. Gira. Names. Yesterday was Gira. Is that <laughs> right? Yeah. Uh, yes, in the uh, Is it Balen? Balen. 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 Oh, right. Mm. I told you, didn't I? <laughs> <laughs> yes, and, and many others. That's a bit unpronounceable. Um, and a few in Budapest as well. So. The concerts of Bonnie M hit and other hits as well, Bob Marley hit, mm -hmm. Ray Charles, African mm -hmm. set, Stevie Lee Hutton gets Stevie. African set is, set is really uplifting, really uplifting experience generally. Mm -hmm. How did your career start? Uh, singing singing in, in, in a hairbrush like all little girls do <laughs> and dreaming about um, exactly the dreams I had as a child is probably what's happening now, more or less. Are you nervous before you go on stage? Good nerves. What about you? Good nerves. You have yeah. to be. You have to. If you're not nervous, then it means you don't care about yeah, exactly. your job, isn't exactly. it? Exactly. That's how I see it. Do you want to be a singer from the race? Race again? Yeah, you? Okay. What about you? I kind of. I wasn't sure. I, I don't. I was singing no, in the church, no. but I no. knew that I, music was going to be a part of things. I must admit, then with me, it was. Yeah. yeah, with me, it's more. It was more because it was more forced. Uh, other things was directly were forced upon me but, uh, by family, which was more yes. academic. So I've got an academic family. Yes, same so here. actually, see, yeah, can you imagine you saying that? Oh, yeah. So Thank singing you. was kind of like taboo. She's a singer. What? So no, but it was always a fantasy in the back of my mind. You know, was it, but, you, but you were this, more accepted. No, the same thing. No, no, I went to. Oh, I was going to go to the fame school. You know, the school fame in New York. Yeah. Year. My parents wouldn't let me go. They said, go so to business school. Same. You have to go to business school. Yeah, so, same, same, yeah, pretty same. much the same. It is like that a lot. Yeah. I think it's like that with a lot of singers. But then uh, many times too, a lot of singers have great support from their families. Yes. They yes. do, though, don't they? A lot of famous ones have had great support from their families. Yes. From day one. What is the place where you must like the tour? Apart from Hungary, um, I like Poland. I didn't like you, Brad. What do you like? Me? I'm more of a South American kind of guy. I like Spain. I like yeah. Spain, Spanish, South America, Venezuela. Yeah, I guess oh, to travel, well, there's different reasons. I like different travel. places for different years. To travel, um, I do love India. I do love Africa. I don't go enough there. And I like South America, mm -hmm. although I don't go enough. Africa, right, we don't get to get there. No, no. And I love the Caribbean, but I also like Scotland, Egypt. I like different places for different reasons, but like um, where you get a nice bath and comfort, comfortable feeling that like you belong is, I guess, the hot parts of the world. In other words, we can't tell you. <laughs> <laughs> we like everywhere. Yes, I think so. I think suffice it to say. <laughs> Oh dear, how it is to be <laughs> indecisive and vague. <laughs> what was your most memorable moment when you were in Birmingham? Um, no, there's too many. I don't know how long we've got. This, but, um, but the most. It's one of them. So it's give hard one. to say. It's hard to say because okay, I'm trying to think of one. A lot of them I'd prefer to forget. Actually, no, <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> I'm trying to pick out something that would fascinate the viewers. Um, I really can't think, honestly. There's just too many. And memorable for different reasons. Maybe not so good as well. But for the good, there's lots. So, but it's just I can't think at the moment. I just had a steam and the, and the smoke, the steam's gone to my head. What was your funniest moment in Bollywood? Yeah, there's many of those. There's as many. Well. I don't know where. Oh, you can tell about the t-shirt. Yeah, she, yeah, the, right. the, the, so she sold yeah. my shirt on stage for the highest bidder. <laughs> she told me she liked it. And she sold to some guy for how much was it? Five hundred euros. Take it off, Chippy. Okay. <laughs> and he took it off. Uh, we got the money. Can't remember. We got what, the money. What, what we oh, the we money did with all that we did. No, probably gave it to charity. Wow. Something like that. That's for us. How do you spend a typical day when you're on tour? 
Well, today for me, in this play, in a place like this, it's, it's easy to spend a wonderful time because it's a beautiful hotel. So I personally just had a wonderful spa session. Mm. Relax. Yeah. Just, same thing, just relax and just taking it easy because you know the night, you know, as the evening uh, progresses to the course concert, the energy starts to build up and you should see us an hour before the show, we're kind of crazy. Yes, yeah, and that <laughs> really helps the show. It, it does. really helps a good show. Yeah, totally crazy and that's really nice buzz. Great to know. <laughs> How did you get into the Bonnie Okay. Through her. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and me? How did I get into it? No, it's a long story. It's it really is a long, long story. How I, how we started. I started with Maisie Williams as a founding members. And um, the rest of the institute was about that, something like that. And the rest is, is, is history. So, and it was um, it's just one of those things that was meant to be. I believe in fate. Meant to be not carried forever. Nothing lasts forever. Things change, the lineups change. Mm -hmm. What is your favourite Bonnie and song? <laughs> well, you know what, I think we have the same opinion, we share the same opinion. For me, it's Mar Baker. Yeah. I never get tired of that. I get mm. tired of all the rest of them. Sorry, I'm just being honest. <laughs> well, Mar but Baker. not Mar Baker, not Daddy Cool and Rescue. These three is a pleasure yes. every time yeah. to do. Yeah. Daddy Cool, Mar Baker yeah. and Rescue. Yeah. 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 Yes. What is the thing that you never told anyone before and all the dogs can do? Right, about the band, yeah, about the band, yeah. Um. Still can't tell you. No, 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 but maybe the name. I don't think many people know what the reason for the name. Frank Farrier, who's the founder, uh, the creator, the producer, the brainchild, and the voice of Bonian as well in many cases. Mm -hmm. A lot of people don't know that. But he thought of the name, how he came, with, came to the name was because he loved a detective series, yes. yeah? Australian, right? Australian yeah. detective series about an Aboriginal detective called Lieutenant Boney. So he, he he adapted that, he took the name, Boney because it had a nice uh, I know, feel mm -hmm. to it. Mm -hmm. And the M was the eternal, I think it's pretty spiritual. So four. he believed it, yeah, eternal four. And W didn't sound right, Boney mm -hmm. W, that wouldn't be right, would it? So he turned that you know so you just made it an M. and the funny thing is i don't think many people know that most the people in bone here have an m their first name or second name is m and mine is bone bone so yes. not many people know that there's a connection there is a connection <laughs> yeah Right, I would say, forget it. <laughs> Don't quit your day job. <laughs> Don't quit your day job. <laughs> Sorry, don't listen to us too. This is the kind of fun we have before the show. No, seriously, you have to think very carefully before you venture into it. And you have to be very serious about it and dedicated. And, and work hard. Without hard work, it's not going to happen. Good that would be my advice. Do you Mine is always like if you're going to go into the music business, first of all, know why. Yeah. Have a respect for music and recognize that music in itself is a language, an international language. Mm. Understand it and know what message you want to give. Because if you don't know what you want to say when you speak a language, how can you speak it? Do you know I would never have been, I would never put it like that. I've never even heard that. That's a really language. nice way to describe it. As an advice to give to people, it's a really picturesque way to put it. It's like music is a language. Yeah, you it can't is. Speak it's a language. beautiful language. If you can't don't speak. learn the language, then you, you can't speak it. You won't succeed <laughs> to speak it. Yeah. What would you like to sing anyway? Right. I suppose it's cliche to say Beyonce. Yeah, it's cliche. It is cliche, yeah. So I changed that one, forget that one. It's also cliche to say Stevie Wonder, although I bet you would call it now. Okay. Um, Tina Turner for me. Really? Yeah, yeah. Okay. No, I did, there's so many. There again, indecisiveness. Because um, I love rock as well, so Stevie Nicks. All strange ones that you wouldn't expect. Um, but I would say um, Beyonce. I mean, it depends on to sing with them or just work with them. It no, depends sing, on, sing a duet with she I would do it. No, I have to think about that one as well. It's, it's typical. It's more the, the soul blues ones. Just pick one name and land on it. I don't know. 
Um, oh, Tina Turner. Okay. Do you know who? <laughs> Ray Charles. And, there you go. And do you know Billy Preston? Billy I Preston. That's a good expect- No, I wouldn't no, expect that. That's no, good. Billy Preston. Soul, rock, like that. Billy Preston. Yes, wow. and the, the girl. There's, there's quite a lot, mm. but for different reasons, I'm, you know, I'm always thinking differently to other people. Mm. That's why it takes me so long to answer your questions. Still Tina Turner for me. Really? <laughs> okay. And that's the thing with, as well as perform- the actual performance, yeah? The thing, do it with? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Do it with, yeah, do it with, I, I really say Red Charles, Blue Preston. Mm-hmm. And um, some of the girls, Chuck Conan and... and uh, even some of them, but yes, Stevie Nicks, as I said, some yeah. of the unusual ones. Depends on the genre. Yeah, and my mood. What are you working on now? Working on a brand new album, I am, called Look Beyond, co written by my team. And it's about, it's about what I've, I've just spoken about. Uh, it's an uplifting, positive message of uh, not giving up, just carrying on and overlooking obstacles and being supportive of yourself and others and um, just to to not be negative not see negativity as a as a hold up just mm. be positive that's that's my album also brad you've got your well we work and we have a, out, we yeah. a single together which uh, we wrote a few years ago and we've taken up and we've recorded it and now we're working on the, producing the video and we're going to be releasing the single soon within the next month or so to the street to the, to the street and also, well, just on the personal side, just working with other projects. We're going to Lebanon to do some recordings there soon. So, but most importantly, is the To the Street single they call it The Shy With Me. That's the number one project for me. What would you say to your fans? Um, God bless you all and be good and be kind. Kindness is the most important uh, attribute that you can have. Thank you. Doesn't matter how much money, if you're not kind, I just think it's just, it just doesn't mm-hmm. doesn't appeal and doesn't attract and, and makes no break in my opinion. Yeah, this is true. So be kind to each other, be respectful of each other and acknowledging each other and uh, helping each other, support, support. There's not enough of that in the world. What's your message? And, and thank you for being my friend. <laughs> wow. I was just like, uh, without friends you don't get very far in this world. Mm-hmm. You need good friends, and when you have people that are your friends and you know that, mm-hmm. then you keep them close. Thank yeah. you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Very nicely <laughs> rounded up. Thank you. You've got a great future. Thank you. Yes. Wow. Very personable young lady. Yeah.